this, and uh, today, in uh, just the span of one hour, he's going to teach me everything about MMA. Everything, right? Everything I can. Everything, yeah. All right, superb. This is going to hurt. Okay, now we're gonna do a little bit of the ground game, uh, which is what people usually tend to say. Oh boy, you know, either that's real MMA. Want me to stop moving? Okay. That's either real MMA or that's the part that bores me. It wouldn't bore you if you knew how complex. You already got it. And uh, awesome or awful it was, depending. So we're gonna do a little bit of that. So, uh, what we're going to do is, uh, he's gonna, take, he's gonna take it very easy on me. And we're gonna go punching, uh, sprawl, a little bit of grappling. Man, you got a big knot. I got a huge knot. It's unbelievable. Standing up portion. Just a little bit of what they do in MMA. Percentage-wise, this is what, 40% of MMA? Oh, it depends on the fight, right? You know? And that's what makes the sport of MMA so exciting. Hey, good. Um, you never know what a guy's strength or weakness is. Yeah. Some fighters, like myself, tend to keep it standing. Some guys are 50-50. The best guys are 50-50 striking to jiu-jitsu. But most people are stronger at one or the other. All right, uh, now you should also know, uh, Diamond told me this, that people come into this gym once or twice a week. Yeah. And, uh, and, and what do they tell you? Oh, um, I want to fight. They say, I want to be a UFC fighter. They say, the sport is mixed martial arts. But they come in, I want to do the, I want to be the UFC thing. And they think that they can fight in the next month or the next eight weeks. And we have to tell them time and time again, it takes a lot of practice, a lot of training to be able to do this and not embarrass yourself or get hurt, you know? Uh, it's gonna look really slow on camera. It's way faster than you think. Good. 